hello friends welcome if you're new to this channel and if you're an old timer welcome back i'm nurse johnson and in this video we'll be talking about how to study as a nursing student in nursing school so um the reason i'm making this video is because um whilst i was a student i made a lot of mistakes that um i wish i had not made and um, I wish I knew a lot of things that I knew now because as at that time um, while studying I did it wrongly and I believe that was one of the reasons why I did not have the best performance I wished I had. So if you are still watching me, please don't forget to subscribe, like the video and you know share it, hit that notification bell icon so that you'll be notified when next I upload videos so i'll be giving you three tips basically so you don't make the mistake i made whilst i was in school so before i proceed let me ask you this question how do you study okay it's a simple question how do you study do you just grab your books you know go to the class or just open it up and start reading do you ever have a plan how do you study well i believe for most of you watching this video uh, the way you study must probably be crap or may probably be the wrong way so i'll be giving you three tips first of all when you want to study please do not multitask and that's one of the mistakes many of you watching me are making you have your phone by your side you have your pc by your side you have your textbook by your side some people are even playing music while studying Okay, I get it. Some of you might say that um, they love playing music or they don't care whether people distract them. Okay, I understand. But please don't multitask while studying. When you want to study a particular subject, focus on that subject. If you are studying math, please don't go and bring an unrelated course like music. Join them and be studying them simultaneously. That won't work and that's not for your own good. So the first tip is don't multitask, focus on the subject you want to study. Number two, you need to have a place of study. Okay, you can't just make your bedroom a place of study. I'm not saying that you shouldn't make it, but what I'm trying to say is that when you want to study, you need to have a specific place of studying. If it's your bedroom, good for you, but it has to be conducive for studying. You shouldn't just go and sit on your bed and assume that while studying on the bed you won't fall asleep you will surely feel sleepy okay if it is your bedroom i advise you that you need to have a chair and a table and possibly a lamp in case you are studying in the night if you are studying the class make sure you go there the same time every day okay just try to establish your routine just time just try to have a place of study number three is that you need to space your studies please give me your listening ear now because this point is obviously the last one but the most important for one reason you see most of you who study actually let's say study for like about four or five hours straight and that's very wrong that's not how you study you don't just grab your book and study for four hours straight like what's wrong with you that's not how you do it you need to space your reading and this is what i mean your brain actually might not be able to hold so much lot of information when you keep cramming it through so what you do basically is that when you study you study for at least let's say 30 minutes then you give yourself a break let's say a break of five or ten minutes you come back after that 10 minutes you study again all right you study for that period of 30 minutes go and have a break maybe talk to friends make a phone call take some water something like that you come back okay so i'm not saying this 30 minutes 10 minutes guide is the you know absolute but what i'm trying to say is that you need to space your reading you study for some time take a break study for some time take a break and i promise you you see lots and lots and lots of results okay um so what i want you to do for me is that go down to the comment section right now and tell me how you study 
okay if there are any other tips i left out why not write them down so that can just you know quickly glance them to read it and implement it if you are watching this video up to now please don't forget to like the video share it and also subscribe for more thank you and i love you all